All right, folks. Well, it's Thursday, so you know what that means. We have our pet of the week, and joining us today is Rebecca Villanueva from Palm Valley Animal Center. Who did you bring with you today? Today we have Bridget. Bridget is a three-month-old Cali blend, and I just want to point out that Bridget is a it has a little uh, nub tail. So <laughs> this is the way she was born. Uh, so she is very cute, very sweet. But of course, you're taking home the full kitten experience. Now, Bridget is super playful, loves people, Aww. but you have to remember that she has all of those super cute and adorable kitten qualities, which <laughs> includes running around at all wee hours of the night. Oh, wow. uh, she, you know, tends to like to play <laughs> with all of her kitten friends. We have her in our loose kitten room. Okay. Um, but she loves people, and she's really sweet. Mm -hmm. And of course, uh, for these cold days ahead of us, mm -hmm. what better than your personal little uh, personal oh. heater. She <laughs> likes to cuddle. She'll fall asleep on your lap if you let her. Um, she was hanging out in my office this morning and she, oh. Oh. After, a, after a while, she relaxed and just kind of laid down. But of course, when you take home a kitten, you have to be ready for all of that energy and that curiosity. Wow, and is it much like a dog? I know dogs are handfuls as well, or is it a little different? It's a little different. Cats tend to be uh, a, definitely a little bit different. They potty trained a lot easier, so uh, Bridget's already potty trained. She goes, she's litter trained, um, and so when you take her home, the only thing to remember is that she's kind of finding her own, you know, she's learning what her little claws do, so it's really <laughs> important to get scratch toys, scratch posts, mm -hmm. get lots of toys to keep her entertained so she can stay away from, you know, things where you don't want her, like uh, cords mm -hmm. and furniture and maybe some outlets or some curtains, and so it's just important that we stimulate them at this age because they have all of that energy. Most definitely, and do you guys have any upcoming events going on? We do. We want to say a big shout out to uh, our folks at Raising Canes. Okay. They're actually selling these adorable little plush puppies right here <laughs> uh, at all of their locations. Um, oh. And when you, apparently Bridget <laughs> likes them too. Yeah. Uh, they, net, of, net proceeds go to helping animals just like Bridget. And of course, uh, they're all participating, all the locations in the Rio Grande Valley. want to say a wow. big thank to Raising Canes. And then if you are planning for winter break, mm -hmm. we are getting ready to take up um, applications and registration for mini camps. Oh. And so if you have kids out there that love animals and mm -hmm. want to learn more about animal welfare, visit our website, pvaconline.com forward slash camps and learn how your kids can be part of our camp program. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for thank coming. Thank you. I know it's chilly outside. We appreciate you guys coming in here. <laughs> All right. Well, folks, we will be back in about two minutes.